I have, I would say, the world's best husband. And I let him be, and he lets me be when it comes to yeah. work. I just mm. knew that I, had, I didn't have a system where you know I was going to be just introduced and said, "Okay, to picture me." Yeah. Yes, yes. Uh, the goal was that okay, it would become easier to get into mm. films if I became a Miss India. When I did yeah. Big Boss, I had yeah. Shahrukh Zade, yeah, game, all of that happened. Oh, but mm. you're not opposite Ranveer Kapoor. not be doing your first film if you're not opposite the actor i'm in the best phase of my career right now hello everyone this is akash patnagar from miss malini and today i'm in the company of one of the most gorgeous person international and someone who has followed her career will understand that reference welcome gaur khan to miss malini i have to say like best seller is garnering praise everywhere especially your character like i was reading some reviews before this interview and you are getting a lot of appreciation firstly how has it been getting the response to you your character and the story it's been overwhelming actually for my anka because uh yeah i am just loving the response uh every single detail that uh, most of the reviews have mentioned about my character i feel so great uh, that oh okay they noticed that oh okay they yeah. noticed that so for me it's yeah. a it's an amazing feeling and uh, all all due credit to uh, the producer and director of the show siddharth and mukul sir they both believed in me as my anka of mm-hmm. course uh, uh, kavish uh, casting director they thought that i would be apt for my anka but i didn't expect of course i i hoped that people will love it mm-hmm. so much but you know in in a in a show where everything is so thrilling and everything is always mm-hmm. you know uh, on the edge and some people are suspicious some people are not usually the people yeah. who are not that suspicious don't have much to do in you know in a in a in a in a thriller but mm-hmm. mayanka even though she's not a part of the actual crime or the mystery she is mm-hmm. just everything that is you know related to the story she is she yeah. is the element that is kind of responsible for unfolding most of the angles in the show so yeah. i'm glad that people like that mm-hmm. and i'm so grateful to all the critics who have given mayanka so much love uh, like you worked with mithun da in this show like you get to work with the legend so how was it getting to observe him getting to learn from him how was that whole process like I loved it. He was a school. Like I would only observe him. I would just watch him, and he was so much fun. You know, he was uh, easy going. He was fun loving. He had the most yeah. amazing compliments for me all the time. Yeah. So I would actually get shy around him. Like you know, look at this is Mithun Chakravarti, the Mithun Chakravarti. You know, paying me compliments about my beauty yeah. or whatever or my talent. I used to be completely like like fl- like floored. I would be like, wow, this yeah. is my dream. I'm living. and uh, okay. you know his son messaged me uh, just yes day before yesterday on 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 instagram and he said god mm. uh, he said you deserve much more and that's that you were fabulous in best seller and i was like mm. wow you know this is this chakravarti son who is praising yeah. my work who i have you know i have father so i was like <laughs> yeah like it's amazing and and i'm so yeah. so grateful for the opportunity i tell you mm. best seller has been everything and more for me you know also like you play uh, here the partner of arjun bajwa in the show so uh, now that you are married yourself what role do you think the uh, support of a spouse uh, play in someone's career in someone getting through the tough times and all it's everything it's everything like i am so grateful alhamdulillah that i have i would say the world's best husband because he yeah. is just he is just everything to me i mean i um you know there there's a lot that people can expect and demand in a relationship mm. and sometimes it only it only comes from a place of you know being in a being in that position like i'm your wife or i'm your husband you know i need this or mm. i want this and and mm. and very few people actually realize that being in a relationship or being someone's support system is just about mm. being you, you mm. can't really uh, your refrafts into it and mm. the, the only reason i'm being able to do all this work trust me right mm. after my marriage it was chauda phere whether it was best seller that i shot yeah. right after my my wedding it's only because of zed and zed has just uh, 
given me that freedom and that trust and that belief mm-hmm. that you know you go do your thing i'm here doing my thing and i let him be and he lets me be when it comes to yeah. work so that yeah. really supports you and you know when you want to fall back he's right there or she's right there yeah. uh and that's the biggest in a relationship trust me Dude. it's just to know that you're not being judged to know that you're not going to be uh you know put under any pressure mm. especially also from my my family has always been there for me and always been my biggest mm. support but to have in-laws that actually don't put that pressure of you know tum bahu ho ya whatever yeah. um mm. is a great blessing i'm very very lucky that my in-laws are also so cool yeah so i just now want to take you a little back in time like when you were joined miss india and went to miss international like at that time there were a lot of crossovers happening between pageants and the bollywood industry like just two years before you like lara ya priyanka and diya mirza had come and then before that a lot of uh, uh, um, people who went into pageantry had come so did you have that kind of expectations like uh, uh, after pageants uh, you also want to join the industry and how was that switch uh, journey of switching like you know honestly my my goal was acting always uh, mm. i just mm. knew that I, had, i didn't have a system where you know i was going to be just introduced and said okay isko picture mein yeah. le lo it's go it was going to be yeah. struggle so I, my father when i was just 17 he showed me an article in the newspaper and that time miss india used to be huge it's a, it was a huge yeah. deal uh yeah. 90s and 2000s and and he showed me and he said go i think this is the year you should go for it i'm like papa i'm so young he's like it's okay padhai hote rahegi just try and i yeah. went ahead and i got through and i became miss india international but yes uh, the goal was that okay it would become easier to get into mm. films if i became a miss india but yeah. um, na- nothing is so easy right so uh, yeah. i was very fortunate that i became one of the top most models of the country the choreographers mm. really liked me on ramp and yeah. you know that was the journey i had and then eventually after 6 7 years rocket singh had to happen and jhalak yeah. jhalak had to happen so my it was yeah. it was slow but i had to prove myself i had to show my presence i had to let people know that there is gohar khan who has mm. this you know um, aspiration and this te- mm. this ability how to perform now eventually yeah. how many people would you know figure that out and mm. now in in, in 2022 people are sitting back and yeah. you know uh, giving the kind of beat that i need so yeah i'm yeah. very 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 grateful for my job it's been fab and one thing that i like about how you have shaped up your career is that with with every actor you can classify them that this person is a tv actor who maybe tried his hand in web or maybe tried his hand in film or vice versa on other mediums with you there is no demarcation like that if you are doing uh, khatro ke khiladi and a big boss you are also you have also done a ishak zade the previous year and if you are doing something on the web then you have also done game you have also done rocket thing so the, how has that been for you not to uh, put yourself and not to let others put you into a certain box akash i think your questions are amazing because not many people sit back and notice and do that kind of research on on people but thank you so much for that and i'm glad that people like you are intelligent enough to know that you know i have i don't have and the, i'll tell you the, the on the contrary when i started off the biggest fear that people put in in minds of you know uh, people who mm. uh, aspire to become an actor they're like mm. oh you know you'll get type and you know agar aap yeah. like gana karoge to aap item girl bulaya jayega aur agar aap tv karoge yeah. to aapko tv actor bulaya and i only wanted to fight that i am like yeah. if i do a song i don't become an item if i yeah. am doing mm. reality shows i it's not that i have no other work because when i did yeah. big boss i had yeah. ashok zade yeah game all of that happened so i was mm. i was i a current actor from the film industry who was a part of big boss mm. and i won that yeah. so you know the 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 whole battle of my career within mm. myself not with anyone else is that mm. i'm going to follow my gut and i have yeah. always done that mm. i'm not going to go by the norms of other people who are going to say ke ye mat karo wo mat karo and all mm. of that like in rock 
people when I when I started talking to people right in Jhalak, and I said, "I get audition, mila, five audition, okay, you know, I'm going to do this part." And uh, you know how people yeah. give advice? They're like, "No, but mm. you're not opposite Ranbir Kapoor. Not be doing your first film if you're not opposite the actor." I'm like, mm. "But the role which is not opposite the yeah. actor is the role that is yeah. going to stand out." So I always, always followed my gut, and that's how, mm. Alhamdulillah, I have ended. This position where today Akash yeah. I can sit back and choose, and I can say that you know, True. and I have always chosen. I have always chosen. Like mm. I, there are big films which uh, you know I had small roles offered in, where mm. I I would have I could have been lured into the fact that it's a very big production house and I'm going to do this mm. role. But I have said no. I've had the courage mm. as a person who was not probably as established at that time. You know, I had the courage to say no because I knew yeah. what I was. I, I deserve. you know and i want mm. what my potential so yeah, yeah. I, it's been amazing but thank you so much for noticing that like chan baby will always be special for like yeah. a lot of people including me and <clears throat> now that uh, you, you have got a lot of good projects in the last two or three years be it on the big screen or the small screen do you feel like you are in a very good phase of your career right now where things are kind of happening the way you would have wanted I'm in the best phase of my career right now because I am doing stuff which is keeping me on a high. I'm constantly working. I am um, constantly being a part of a project there where I know that it is going to be fruitful. Uh, mm. Bestseller has just been amazing for me. I had never yeah. uh, imagined that you know a cast of uh, uh, six, seven, eight people and Gohar Khan mm. is going to be the headline of of a review, uh, yeah. and and not. fun like multiple and multiple and yeah. i i am so grateful for that i'm so grateful um when i i read in one of the reviews uh, the line was now let's skip to to the good part and that is gohar <laughs> i was like i was like wow yeah. wow so, yeah. so i'm in the best phase of my life akash and i'm hmm. i'm actually grateful uh super grateful to filmmakers to production houses hmm. such as art malotra who actually knew clearly that okay gohar mm. deserves my anka you know? so yeah. uh, i'm i'm hoping that i'll always be riding on this high and uh, doing work that is going to get me and my audience is super excited uh wishing you lots and lots of love and luck for everything that you are doing the place that you are in a career right now you rightly deserve so and you deserve a lot more for that so i hope yeah. that you get much more success and much more love and appreciation than you are getting right now and wishing you lots and lots of love and luck it was a great conversation me for me hope it was for the same for you thank you so much for joining thank you akash thank you so much for your kind words and i'll speak to you soon